In 2030, I envision a Wikipedia that is inclusive, that is gender balanced and that is locally relevant. I see that with the increasing automation and growth in technologies like OCR, speech to text, artificial intelligence, the very basis of the movement that is the collective wisdom would be disrupted in a massive way. Today, 350 people from 70 countries are coming together to learn, to work and celebrate how big and diverse an international movement we are. The Wikimedia Conference gathers a lot of people who are involved in planning, strategic meetings and things like that to build bridges between um, different user groups and affiliates and it uh, brings us all together to exchange ideas and to think strategically about the movement, about our movement, where we are heading. My wish is that uh, we will be successful in this process and we can actually have people on board the whole way and, and actually have this inclusive strategy that we are dreaming of for the whole movement. Movement strategy update now. It's time for the... Hello, hello? Ah, yes, okay. So last time I stood in front of you, we were here in process planning. There was a board meeting in November in which the board said this seems like a good way to move forward. And now we are here at the end of, it's February, right? At the end of February with Wikimania coming up, annual planning in the works. We've been having a lot of conversations with folks here in this room, with folks in our community, and ultimately come to a few goals for movement strategy. And I just want to review those quickly. Identify a cohesive or coherent direction that aligns us all and inspires us around what it is that we might do. Build trust, goodwill, and alignment within our movement. Part of the outcome is the process itself. Better understanding the people and institutions that make up our movement. Build a shared understanding of what it means to be a movement. Building relationships that expand and enrich our movement over time. Today, I'm going to talk to you about something very exciting that has been happening for the past months. We have been incorporating a new voices to the conversation. And by new voices, we mean experts, we mean thought leaders, we mean partners, we mean allies. But the most exciting part is that a lot of affiliates across the globe are also engaging in this process and they're organizing their own events. And so far we've had events in Chile, in Cote d'Ivoire, in Poland. This is the consensus findings that we have to date. Wikimedia should be an influencer in shaping world policy for access to knowledge. Inclusivity and new representation can be only forged on lower barriers to entry. As learning platforms evolve, we need to think beyond the encyclopedia. Knowledge sharing is highly social. Privacy and anonymity are still relevant. Is there something that you could say about, uh, it doesn't matter if we don't all understand, um, but why you are here in Ukrainian? My name is And in English? I was invited here. Go to Ebe Agamata, Ingeni Ile Ichawe Mata Noa. It means uh, on Wikipedia you can find almost everything you want to know about the world.
We need to bring more educational resources, more um, educational networks uh, to, to collaborate with, uh, with Wikipedia and its projects. Most of the time there is this issue that Africans don't get a chance to say their own story. My ambition has always been to get more content around Ghana and Africa on Wikipedia and make it accessible to the world. It's also my, uh, my wish that in the near future we can successfully make every Wikipedian feel less alone. I would like to see more people involved from different regions between different continents and different contributors because at the very end we are all human beings and we have knowledge that has to be shared. Get all the content from all the societies, all the communities in the world, make Wikipedia a truly global knowledge resource.